hello guys welcome back to NRCalc video tutorials in this video tutorial I'll show you uh, how to design and analyze a heavy wood beam so let me just select first open NRCalc and select this add button in my project manager I'll say wood beam so first I'll start with a simple southern pine beam and then I'll show you how to use a heavy beam when you have high loads so let's say heavy beam as my description and over here for design values I'll go to I'll select this button and I'll select this 2 inches to 4 inches thick and 2 inches and wider uh, I'll go to southern pine which is the general um, grade of wood that we use so in southern pine I'll say let's say number 2 12 inches wide ok there you go so I selected number 2 2 to 4 inches thick and 12 inches wide I'll go to beam span data 10 feet looks good let it let us make it 12 feet and all this doesn't change I'll select a wood section southern pine 2 by 12 and now I'll add some loads let's add a UDL load of 0.8 kip per feet which is way high it looks like let me just make it 0.25 and over here 0.25 so now as you can see I have used two 2 by 2 wells and let me try three 2 by 2 wells so even three 2 by 2 wells are failing so what do I do in this case so in this case I'll just use a heavy beam which is a manufactured beam nothing but PSL so I'll go over here I'll dis select this button display wood material database I'll go to manufactured over here and I'll say PSL 2.0 E which is usually used for beams I'll select that I'll come to beam span data and I'll select my parallel arm over here and I'll select a beam which whichever fits like so this 3.5 by 9.25 is nothing but 409 so 409 works so this PSL beam nothing but 409 PSL works perfectly for whatever the loads I have provided for example if I add an extra load of Two two kips at five feet, let's say, and it fails. So I can just go and increase my beam width. And this will be nothing but now four one four PSL. I hope you got that. So it's the same case anywhere you design a wood beam you make sure it works for 2 2 by 12 or 2 3 2 by 12 and if it doesn't then you go to manufactured beam nothing but PSL okay and you get your results so you can even view a 3d drawing of this nothing but 4 so the height will be 14 inches and width will be 4 inches I mean 3.5 inches over here you have your drawings for movement shear and deflection for that beam and also a sketch which shows the 2D, 2D drawing calculations deflections 
Alright, so I hope you understood what I was talking about, heavy beams, heavy wood beams. Thank you for watching the video.